in this tutorial i am going to share 10 time saving advanced excel tips to make you an excel expert let's start with trick number 1 here we can see that we have few cells filled however there are blank cells in between so task is to copy the filled cell and paste till we get the next filled cell so how we can do this quickly i'll select the range then on home tab on right hand side i'll go to special in this window i'll select blank then press ok at this stage on the first cell put equal to sign and select upper cell and at this stage press control enter and we can see that we can achieve the required task quickly so trick number two is how we can sum values in a range quickly so here we can see that we have data in four columns so what i want first i want to sum on cell b7 for these filled cells so normally what we can do is we can apply sum formula but here i am going to tell you that we can use a shortcut that is alt and equal to sign so when i press alt equal to sign it will sum the consistent upper range automatically and we can press enter so without writing sum formula we can just use alt and equal to sign so let me delete this now what i'll do with the help of control button i'll select all these yellow cells one by one so now i have selected all four cells and i am going to press alt and equal to we can see that automatically all the ranges are calculated for some so this is how quickly by using alt and equal to sign we can sum any consistent range trick number three sometimes in excel we need to change data from row to column or from column to row so how we can do that we can just copy the data by using even control c and then select any cell and right click paste is special and here while pasting values we need to select transpose option and press ok so by using transpose we can change data from row to column and from column to row let's move on to another trick that is trick number four number four is about using control option in excel so let's say i want to fill any value in the selected range quickly so how i can do that i will select a range and type anything so let me type india and what i'll do i'll press control enter so we can say that quickly we can enter any value in selected range by using control enter option so here we can see that i have data in d column and this data i want to multiply by 2 so how i'll do that i'll select the range then i'll use equal to sign that will automatically go into first cell select the left cell and use multiplied sign and 2 and here also i'll press control and enter so we can see that by using control plus enter option we can do many tasks very quickly now let's move to trick number five trick number five is about how we can move data on excel sheet quickly so the first way is to select data and move the pointer to the border so let me select some data i'll select c and d column where we have data and move the pointer to the border we can see that sign is changed so i'll pick this data and move anywhere quickly in the same manner i can select these two columns and then pick this data 
and move towards right so without using cut and paste copy and paste we can use this way like to select data and move the pointer to the border and then pick data and move anywhere on this sheet so this is how we can move our data on a spread sheet very quickly now let's see what is trick number six so we can select any field cell or any cell i would say in a field range so i am selecting d1 and when i press ctrl a we can see that entire field range is selected now if i click anywhere else or i select any cell outside the field range and then i press ctrl a then entire sheet is selected but there is another way of selecting entire sheet by just one click of the corner button at left side so we can see here this small arrow sign so when i click this we can select the entire sheet so this is how by using just one click we can select entire sheet now let's move to trick number seven trick number seven is about how to insert multiple blank rows quickly we know that how to add one new row or column but sometimes it is really wastage of time when we need to insert more than one rows or columns so here we can see that we have some data now let's say i want to insert three lines between row number one and two so what i'll do for that instead of inserting rows one by one i'll select three rows and then right click and press insert so we can see that all three rows are inserted in one time let me press ctrl z and let's see one more example now i want to insert one blank row in between two filled rows so i need to insert multiple rows but between two filled rows so how we can achieve that i'll select each filled row one by one individually by using control button so i'll keep pressing control and then selecting one by one each row so here we can see that i have selected all the rows but one by one so once we select all the rows this way we can use control and plus sign and we can see that we have inserted one blank row between two filled rows automatically in one time trick number eight this trick is about how to delete multiple blank cells on a sheet quickly from a selected range so what i'll do here we can see that we have many blank cells so i'll select entire range where we have data then i'll go to find and select option that we have on home tab and go to special and here we can select blank option press ok and then we can right click and delete and we can delete all the blank cells in one effort so this is how we can quickly delete multiple blank cells from any selected range trick number nine is about how we can rename any excel sheet quickly so we just need to double click on the sheet name so here i'll double click here and we can give any name let me give name as abc so by just using double click we can rename any sheet now the last trick that i'm going to share in this tutorial or i would say 10th trick is how we can get unique data out of any selected range so i'll select this range and then i'll go to data tab where i have option as advanced filter i'll select advanced filter option we get this window here i'll just select unique records only and then copy to another location and when we select this option copy to another location we can give reference to any cell i'll give reference to h1 and press ok so we can see that by using the advanced filter option we have achieved unique data out of any selected range so these are the 10 advanced excel tips that can make our life easier while working in excel 
so thanks for watching this tutorial if you like this tutorial please share your feedback and subscribe to my channel for next and more advanced excel hacks thanks again